Listen to the serenity, my friends, the serenity. G'day my friends, today I'm lucky enough to be at Rakai Hut, South Island, New Zealand. Just take a look around here. We've got a beachcomber there on a four-wheel bike, awesome. Look at that my friends, we've even got a floating picnic table. <laughs> is that awesome or is that awesome? And if you come around here and have a look, look at this beautiful clear day. Isn't this wonderful? If you come around here and have a look, you can see we've got the camping ground right here my friends, right here, right next to the sea. A lot of people who stay in this camping ground are really keen on fishing so they get the old surf casting rod and they see what they can catch. They catch salmon and all sorts of stuff around here. It's pretty awesome guys. So my friends, if you're travelling around New Zealand in a camper van, we'll go and check out the camping ground and we'll see what it's going to cost you to stay here and everything good like that and what sort of facilities are available. Now if we have a look down that direction my friends, we're heading towards Christchurch. That direction about 60 kilometres. But if we go right round, notice there's nobody on this beach. You can have a whole beach in the South Island of New Zealand to yourself. Come all the way round. In that direction there, my friends, as we're heading down south towards Timaru. Oh, look at this. Isn't this an idyllic setting? Listen to the serenity, my friends. The serenity. Doesn't take much to amuse me, eh? You've probably gathered by now if you've watched any of my other videos. But I like the fact we can still get away these days and still luck be on your own. Well, not 100% on your own. You're pretty close to a city and that sort of stuff. But there's no other bug around to annoy you. That's what I like. Yeah! Where else in the world are you going to get this view by yourself? Unbelievable. So here we have the Rakaia Huts camping ground, my friends. Let's have a look, see what they charge. Casual rate up to two weeks, 15 bucks a night, two adults. Oh, that's pretty cool. A non-powered site, 10 bucks a night, two adults. Yeah, it's even better. Seasonal rate, so you get it uh, cheaper if you're here for a longer time. A non-powered rate, seasonal rate, that's cool, eh? That's pretty good value, I think, guys. Awesome. And a beautiful place to stay too, by the look of it. Right by the sea. Now normally with that sort of money you uh, wouldn't even get like a powered site but you get your own power here and everything and I think there's also a kitchen some other bits and pieces here as well so let's go and have a look we've got a playground for the kids which is awesome and you look at the uh, the view we're getting here guys isn't that awesome we've got a little lake right down the front there and then we go right over to the sea and you can spend all day on the beach fishing or whatever you want to do Obviously this is a recreation area, we can't camp so close to the sea, but we can just camp over here guys, see that? Isn't that awesome? Look at the surroundings, isn't that cool? Is that cool or is that cool? So let's have a wander around and, and see what we can see. Only really the start of spring here and it's already like half full of this camping ground. Probably because of the value for money, I would say. So we've even got a shower block here for that money guys, wow. And we've got tents and caravans and see we've got tents there caravans, all sorts of stuff. We've got toilets, a shower, kitchen and a community room. That's pretty cool, eh? For that money, it's awesome. So let's have a look at the kitchen, guys. What have we got? How are you, mate? You well? Yeah, good. That's a nice little kitchen too, isn't it? It is. Yeah. For that money? Wow. Um, really reasonable rates here, I thought. How long have you been here? We're just moving in now. We're going to be here for a few months. We're going to build the house. So. Oh, really? So you're not a tourist? Oh. <laughs> You're a local. Oh, from Christchurch. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm Pete, how you going? Good. So that's how you knew what it, how yeah. it existed and everything else? Yeah. Yeah. So well, what do they do over here? What is it? Is it fishing and that sort of stuff? Ah, uh, yeah. There's a lagoon out there. Yeah. And they can launch a net and take pit boats down to the Rakaia River. Oh, really? Or they can go, just fly a wee bit on a motorbike and go along the beach to the Rakaia. Cool. Is it a good fish? I think there was a, a salmon fishing competition salmon. or something there. Yeah, and uh, it's white bait season at the moment. Yeah. Oh, that's good. Does it get packed in the summertime? Yeah. Yeah, yeah I'd say so. You probably have to pre book. Yeah. Yeah. yeah we, so, what are you? Are you in a caravan? Or are you in a, in yeah, a, yeah, yeah, we're just sitting one up now, all living that for a few months while the house is getting built. Cool. Cool. So, there we go, guys. 
Look at that. We've even got permanent people living here. Well, Cindy permanent. <laughs> so would you recommend it for overseas tourists? A lot of my people yeah. watch my channel are from overseas. Yeah, yeah. So they're looking for somewhere cheap, nice and tidy and, and clean, basically. Yeah, that's probably a good a good start from Christchurch. Yeah, not too far, eh? No. And you can go sort of any direction and do your own yeah, thing. Yeah. Hey, mate, thank you very much for helping no us out. No worries. Well, seeing a good luck with your house building, mate. Yeah. <laughs> Cheers. Thank you. Well, there you go, my friends. Just another friendly Kiwi that you're going to meet on your holidays. Pretty awesome, eh? So we've even got people in tents over there, right from the big flash caravans there, right to the motorhomes, right to the vans. It's all here, my friends. It is all here. So I think that's pretty good value personally, but like I say, I like free, but I also like cheap. Cheap is awesome, eh? And I couldn't agree with the sign more, my friends. One thing you want to do when you're here is clean up after yourself. Take away your rubbish. Don't leave anything that you didn't take in, take it out again. Whether you're climbing up through the mountains or whatever you're doing, just make sure you take your stuff out with you. Oh, we've got someone moving campsite by the look of that. Awesome. So, my friends, an awesome camping ground. Well, I think so anyway. Great for the kids. It's not too far out of the Christchurch Central, and you can go wherever you want. You can go skiing, you can go fishing, you can go hiking, you can do a whole lot of stuff. And it's cheap. Anyway, guys, remember if you like my videos, subscribe, drop me a like, drop me a comment. Check up on the side. I'll put another couple of videos up there for you to have a look at. And we'll see you next time, mate. Bye.